Your Kassot, welcome back to Hyperlight Drifter. I am back, even if my voice isn't entirely, so I apologize for any uh, weird sounds as you may hear, but I, at least this time I have the audio channels going in the right places, so you probably won't hear as much of the defects in my voice as you would otherwise. So anyway, in the last episode, we were up in the northern area. We finished that off. We got all eight cores from the northern area. Meanwhile, we then went back to the eastern area because uh, the laser rifle to do the uh, crossing all those platforms, which I think was in this area here somewhere. But rather fruitless search getting that last core. So I'm tired of the eastern area. You're probably tired of the eastern area too. So instead, I'm going to pick a new direction and I'm heading west. I guess that was, you know, going to be forthcoming anyway. But, um... So now we know where we'll be going last. Well, that is if I, you know, continue going through here. Now, things are feeling a little bit sluggish at the moment. I don't know if my PC is behaving itself right now. Uh, but otherwise, we should be on our way to, uh, getting everything, and, uh, heading west, I imagine it's going to be much the same as it has been previously, so, go west, get all the stuff. Grab everything that'll be coming our way. Gemini pieces, those sorts of things, though I don't really know what to spend all of my Gemini pieces on. I mean, I've got one. I'm sort of running out of abilities that I actually want to, well, spend my Gemini pieces on. Anyway, let us head into this western area here, and I think I can walk on that blue. Or is it purple? It looks purple. Anyway, I can walk on it. Alright, well, that was a health pack I didn't actually need. No, probably going to jump off the edge if I go down there. Let's see if I can last one entire episode without falling off. Okay, so, now we enter the west and it appears to be some sort of crystalline forest, maybe. I'm still hearing the city music vaguely. I mean, I'm not seeing any secret paths around here, any little indicators. Though, maybe I can go down here. Yes, I can. But is there anything for me down here? That's the question. So, the last time I came through and my basically first attempt at Hyperlight Drifter, this was the second area I came to. Of course, I didn't finish off the northern area. So, I don't remember everything from this area. In fact, I hardly recall. I mean, I remember one particular room I had a lot of difficulty with. But other than that, there's um, a lot of new experiences, I should think. Such as this lift. I don't remember that. Alright, well, let's have a look on... The chart, we're probably here, or we could be here, but there doesn't seem to be a lot in the way of underground. So, that will be interesting. But I imagine it's much the same again, I guess there's eight cores, of which we've just found our first one. And it looks like there's been a battle here. I'm a little bit wary about this. Oh well. Let's do the thing. Grab the core. Number one of eight. So. Oh, yep, of course, all the lights go out. So where are we? Oh, we are in that first room. Okay. Of course, let's just do a quick check around the place. So since I last picked up the game, I've actually moved house. So just today, as I record this, I took the last of my belongings 
from the old house to the new house. So that was a lot of fun, especially with me being unwell. It's probably the reason why I was unwell. Just all the dust and everything that accumulated over the years. But at least now, the hard part is over. I guess now I just have to work on putting everything into its place, or finding a place for everything, I should say. So I still have a little bit of a difficulty with that. My bedroom stroke studio is not as large as the old one was, and you may hear a slightly different acoustic in my voice. The room's a bit smaller, it's a little bit drier, so my voice sort of, I guess, echoes or falls short a little bit. I mean, in front of me now is a curtain instead of a wall, but even then, it's sort of not helping with uh, the acoustics as much as I would like, so I guess my voice is slightly harsher and it doesn't help from the uh, illness that I've had the past week or so as well. Anyway, I guess you're going to tell us about the boss of this area. Okay. So, there seems to be some sort of kneeling guy with a sword, unless that's you. Nope, that's our boss. He's all the way over at the very end. Okay. So we've got a great big warrior thing. Looks like another bird. And this looks like a path leading to something good, maybe. Well, another health kit. I'm eating them like candy. They're not good for me right now. And yet I'm consuming them. Right, so... What else lies in this area? Oh, I can't use the sword anywhere near him. That... well, that makes sense. Oh, but I can destroy these crystal things. Okay, so there are bushes here. Now, of course, I'm going around worrying about having a uh, secret path that I've neglected. I haven't seen any secret marks anywhere. So, deeper into the forest, we get a new layer to the music. Ooh, a little bit more ominous. Okay, minions. Now, what guns have I currently got? Alright, I've got the shotgun and I have the laser rifle. So that's the laser rifle, that's the shotgun. I think this is the one I'm going to want for this battle. Alright, so you take three hits. Alright, you're backing up. Okay, that was the wrong gun. This is the shoddy. Here we go. It's been a couple of weeks since I've played. Oh, no. That was naughty. Come back here, you. Well, not into me. Alright, well, let's pick up this Gemini bit. Oh, more coming out of the bushes. Oi! Didn't expect you to do that. Oh, there's black things. Oh, of course, that's me from losing health. Well, let's do something about that. Okay. There's a thing over there. There's a Gemini bit over there. Maybe we walk through the forest. Maybe there's a secret way. I get the feeling there's going to be lots of secret ways through trees in this area. Can I get around this? No. Well, that's a bit rude. Okay, we have to... I guess... Come at it from following all those paths over there. Okay, so we've got to find a way around. 
So I guess this means I just follow the top path wherever I can. Though, this is feeling very maze-like already. I mean, even though there's only like a few paths, it's... Oh, it was a fireplace for him. This was their camp and I disturbed him. Right, that makes sense. Okay, so I guess we go around and up through the trees there. Or I could possibly go this way. So what's on the map? Alright, we're in this area here. Underground, we have something over here. Probably another core room. Oh, another health kit. Let's just leave that one alone for now. Right. Now. I feel like there should be something here. My, my senses are tingling. It's probably just that health kit, though. Alright. Let's head up through... Is that a fallen log or is that one of the giants? Okay, I guess we go up the stairs. But I want to... I want to get through here. That's where that Gemini bit is. How do I do that? Maybe the path is much longer than I first thought. Yeah, I need to... Go around up there somewhere. Alright, there's a lot of... A lot of mysteries yet to be solved and a lot of mysteries yet to be uncovered. Now, why have a post there and some bushes? Thought it'd be a secret. Okay. Now, is there anywhere else I can go from here or is that it? Just this wheelbarrow and a well. Can't interact with the well. Doesn't look like I can go down the well. And that's not a little pathway through there at the bottom of the screen. Alright, this is a little dead end area with a Gemini bit in it. Oh, okay, presumably that northern path is our northern path. Now, are these breakable? No. Now, why does that one over there have a... an icon on it? What does this mean? I mean... Can I shoot it with the laser? Maybe? Nope. That doesn't look promising. And what I thought was a hidden mark isn't. Okay, now. Oh, we'd make it from that mark over there. All right. So I've just come the wrong way. Okay, I like boxes. I like destroying things. Zelda has taught me well. But it doesn't look like there's much here at the moment. Okay. Another health kit. Anything else in the area I can interact with? No. Alright, why have bushes there? Are they hiding a path through the trees, maybe? No? Okay. Alright, let's... Okay, oh dear. No, get out of it. Okay, that's a... locked door. And, ah, here's our little secret mark. Right, well, we'll come back to the locked door, because I know where this is going to go. In fact, I'm going to ch change my gun real quick. Okay. 
Might as well use that, uh, spear attack from time to time. Okay, lots of, uh, platforming here. Okay, it's one of those things there. Now, the last time I had one of those, I was able to shoot something in the distance. And of course, that was in the eastern area, so... Maybe the same rules don't apply here. It doesn't look like there's any hidden way up there. What about in this area over here? Oh, there's a symbol on the ground there. Oh, that does lead north. Okay. Well, maybe that locked door's gonna have to wait a while. What lies up here? Aha. A nice little spring with another Gemini bit in it. Up oh, there's number two. And a monolith. Now, I'd like to be able to get to that. Okay, so we're going to have to find our way around here. I don't think there's any way up. No, we're going to have to come to it from the west somehow. So, lots of things to keep in mind. Maybe that locked door will take us there. Okay, let's just check to the west here. Nope, nothing. Right. Ooh, that was a close one. Now, was there anything hidden up here? No. Uh, I've just become so paranoid about leaving things behind. Okay, well, we've got seven keys, and apparently this only requires three. There we go. So maybe this will bring us around to the monolith. It sort of has that feel about it. I mean, if I look on the map, we're in that area up there, so probably. Okay. Oh, the crystals regenerate. I sense this is going to be the theme of a particular puzzle. Yep, there they go. They're back. Oh, no. And they trap you. Okay. Got to keep that in mind. Ooh. Now, just as well I can use my sword to get out of everything, but... Maybe I need to use a shotgun or something, and why have all this back here? What am I supposed to be getting towards? Hmm. Now, are any of these hiding something? Okay, the big one's too big. Oh! Did I just fall down? I hope not. Anyway, here's our monolith. Okay, it looked like another bird man. I mean, mind you, the monolith chamber is connected to the northern areas, so... And there was a giant library up there. So I guess the bird people are the custodians of the monoliths, maybe? Or some sort of bird people are. But there we go, there's another one down. Hmm. I do wonder what they're for. Maybe that's what leads to the end of the game. Well, we'll have to try and get as many as we can. Oh, I don't want to waste it just for one hit point. Alright. So now that that area is satisfactorily explored, I suppose. We still haven't found where that other room is, so maybe it's in the next area. Ah, there it is. So we're there, yep, we're on top of that. So we have to make it to there. Somehow. And there's a lot of, uh, ominous music right now. 
Okay, so it's up a level. Oh, it's the wolves. No. Okay, I think we're going to see them a lot. In the area. Oi! Alright, let's go back and get that health kit. Oi! Oh, wow. Helps if I can aim. Really helps if I can aim. Okay. Well, everything will sort of reset now. Oh, they got little antlers on their heads. That's kind of cute. But they're not howling. Why are the wolves howling? Oh, now they are. Now I can hear them. Just the music's really loud. Alright. Well, let's see if I can make it round. Oi! No. Alright. I'll take your advice. I'll heal up. Hang on. LB, that's it. It's been a little while. Okay, why have that here? For effect, I suppose. Oh no! And I was trying not to fall down all episode. Okay, well this will bring us around to the lift at least. So let's see where this takes us. Probably to another core. Ooh. Oh dear. Something here doesn't agree with us. Is it these things? Maybe we should destroy them. Or maybe we should just Zelda and destroy them anyway. Well, I'll take another one of those, thank you very much. I don't know what sort of sacrilege we're doing. Okay, nothing seems to be up here. I don't see any little secret marks. Hmm. Okay. Nope, nothing through here. This is our introduction room, obviously. And now it's locked. Now where are we? Oh, we're in a battle. No, thank you. Alright. I just wait for my stamina to recharge a bit. Okay. Oh, and you actually move around. Okay. Oh, they're still coming. No. Alright. Well, at least we got that for our troubles, but... Not keen. No, I don't want a health kit for one HP. Okay. Have we got everything now? And the way is open again. So maybe this is how we... Maybe we're here and this is how we get into the rest of the zone. Hmm. Not sure what to think about that. And are those doors back there that I've neglected? Well, I suppose I'll see you soon. 
No, I'm not done with this area up here yet. Especially with a doorway right here. Okay, it seems to be a tree or something. Now, there is a secret back here, obviously. Another one. And you don't have any keys or anything of that nature. That's a shame. So... Is this someone's hovel? Perhaps. Well, let's see what's inside. Did that just shake? You're trapped inside crystal. How do I get you out if you're trapped in the crystal? Is the crystal itself the issue? Because I can't use anything. I can't do anything in here. So what do I do to destroy the crystal? I mean, looks like there's been two other crystals here and those people have freed themselves. So why not you? There's nothing that you can tell me. I can't use the sword against you. It's a very interesting... I don't know, I can't use my gun. It won't let me. So we're up there now. Is there anything off to the east of here? Looked like they might have been on the map. So I'm a little bit suspicious, but no, it doesn't look like it. Alright, so... Heading back out here. So that went round to the left and takes us to the south. What have we got if we keep going this way? Well, another health kit. At least they're generous. Hang on, is that a secret mark? No. What about here? Oh no. Yeah, get away from me. Yeah, okay, the wolves are going to be a problem. Oh, there's two secret marks here. Does that mean there's another one here? Alright, let's just keep following it down. Let's keep that bush there so I know where to come back to. This looks vaguely monolithic, but I don't think it is. No. These crystals. Maybe this one in the middle is blocking something. Yes, it is. Well, those panels on the walls don't seem to do anything. Oh, well, we're nearly at our third Gemini bit. Okay, but why have two secret marks here? I have two. Is there something else down here? Like a hidden southern path, maybe? No, that didn't seem to be blocking anything. Okay. Well, let's keep following this around. Or is that it? 
Okay, that seems to be it. So, our way forward is through that lift and out the southern gate. Now, why are there these marks? Does that mean... They look very suspicious, like... Like the secret marks in the ground. Yeah, it's a bit... Puzzling. Oh, this pot's back. No, that's not a door. That's not a door. And that's not a door either. No, there's no... Hidden pathways. And given that we fell little here, this... Must be a sign. That this is the way forward. So, what lies ahead? More forest, it seems. And that is where we will pick up in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, folks. Until next time, Otsukare-sama.